Hello again, everyone. It is your Black Knight. And today we're doing a video with kind of a mission, with a purpose. And we're going to start that mission at Bahama West Mamma Mia. And on that track, created by Bob Jilly. The track I play more than any other. Simply because it's in my favorite place in the whole game, Del Perro. It allows me to teleport myself back to to home base, essentially, whenever I, I want to. But that's not why we're doing it today. Okay, today we're not going to use one of our cars. First of all, we're going to change the color to red. I think red is going to be the right color for this video. Just regular old red. And the vehicle we're going to pick is none other. Where the heck is it? The Itali GTO. Now, the Itali GTO is an interesting vehicle. Oh, do I, did I really burn through 12k worth of ammo? Oh, wow. Yeah, let's, let's get that. Because I'm sure if you follow anything in, in GTA, you're aware of what are called advanced handling flag. Which means that the new cars have these, these variables associated with them. I would prefer to call them advanced handling variables. Because flags, especially in kind of a code sense, indicates that it's more something where there's a, a tick box, like a, a, a radio box. The flag is set or the flag is not set. And these cars with the advanced handling flags seem to have some variability to them, like it's a slider, something more like that. But advanced handling sliders probably doesn't really sound all that good. And uh, so they go with flags. And with the Italian PTO, they haven't set the flags that slow it down over bumps. Like, you know, some of the other cars that we've seen of late, like the, like the Dominator GTX. So, with this car you can curb boost. But, the cost of that, and we're gonna, you can probably see that when we get on this straightaway here, is that it will curb boost, but look at how bouncy it is. I mean, this is, this is like someone dipped the entire car, you know, Dean Jones stole this car, dunked it in the tank of Flubber, or, or if you prefer, Robin Williams did. Depends on which version of Flubber you prefer. I, it's hot. Look at that. Wow! I was driving in a straight line, made a slight adjustment, just a lane change, and it hopped out. This means, now, all this hopping is speeding the car up, so you're getting a lot of top speed out of it. Boingy 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 boing boingy 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 It's a very boingy car. There is much boinginess to it. This means that it's it's not particularly a good car if you're driving in, in any way seriously. If you're doing regular street races, you're gonna you're gonna be way ahead of the pack. And then that's gonna happen, you know, or it's gonna boing out on you like it did that one time and spin you out. Look at this. I mean, that thing is bouncing a foot in the air. You're gonna be doing this, this, and this, and say, hey, okay, here's a turn. And you're not even gonna have the wheels on the ground to make the turn. Yeah, exactly. Whoa! Like, this isn't really great hand. You know what I mean? Now, where it might work would be on a stunt track where it's perfectly smooth. Uh, and then you lose the benefit of the uh, the curve boosting. So, you know, if you do curve boost, you might completely spin yourself out. And it wouldn't be a bad car for kicking around if it wasn't almost $2 million. Um, it is pretty. I mean, let's, 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 I just lost the hood and I beat it up a little bit, but... It is pretty. I mean, you know, you can't fault it for... Let's see, is the other side less scratched? No. The problem is it's a pretty car, but it's almost always going to look like this because it's going to just bounce into things. I mean, that's just what it does. Now, there, this isn't, like, obvious stuff. I'm setting just the background here for the conversation. Uh, in case you didn't know what an advanced handling flag or uh, the advanced handling variables, as I like to call them, are. The new cars tend to have this. And uh, one of the guys who's really a, you know, a 
proponent, a proponent, proponent of getting rid of them is YouTuber Ruffy1322, who thinks they should just be removed from all the times. Like, this is a great rock star. This has been a great experiment. We know you're kind of figuring out what you're going to do for GTA 6 or something, or just, you're just vicious about stuff. I don't know. But for whatever reason, you've given us these advanced handling flags. Please take them away. And he has a, uh, I'll put links in the description. He's got a, uh, a letter writing campaign going on. He's got a petition going on. He wants people to share his video. I will share his video on the subject below. And if you're into racing in, uh, in GTA, you're not following Ruffy, you really should. This, this is the guy where if you want to know who, what car is fastest around the track, he's the one who will test it rigorously. Um, well beyond anything I'd have the patience for. See, that just a quick, quick 180 I didn't intend. And he'll tell you what the fastest car is. And it's, it's not going to be the Itali GTO. The Itali GTO is potentially one of the fastest car in the game, but you're going to be going really fast when you go backwards into the bushes, and that's the problem. If it didn't have these flags, it'd be just incredible. So, one of the things that Ruffy would like us to do as part of this overall protest, and along with the petition and the letter writing and the this and the that, again, all links in the description, is to make a purchase. Yes, 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 if we go to the legendary motorsports, you can see the the benefactor Schlagen GT is now available for 1.3 million. And this car is very special because it is the only car they have released thus far that does not have the handling flags. I'm tempted to do this in like a bruffy orange because it's a bruffy request. But boy, somehow this car just calls to me in green and I don't know why. Like I should just do it in like a silver or do the whole bruffy sun, you know, sunrise over sunset kind of orange that I think is his formula, but I'm not real sure. But, I mean, we should do that just so we can remember the purpose of the whole thing is a bruffy thing. But I have a feeling it would look so good in like a yellow or a green or some, some top gear thing calling to me. Let's, but I think I have still one spot left in Del Perro. All right, 1.3 million dollars. Whoa, well, we're waiting for it. You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna finish off. There's a couple of purchases that I need. Well, I don't really need, but to kind of on an emotional level. Okay, the last of my import-export vehicles, the Technical Aqua. I now have one. Okay, we have to go, come on. The Wastelander, finally. Oh, look at this. You make it green. It's this uh, green. Oh, yeah, we have to paint this. GT, and then, you know, you're basically voting with your, your, your pocketbook here. You're what can the best mechanic in LS do for you? If people don't buy the GTO, but they buy the Schlagen GT. Better than when she came in, that's I'm not even sure. going to tweak it, tweak, tweak it, tweak it the whole way up. I just want to give it a paint job here. Let's see, what, what kind of exhaust? Race side exhaust? No, 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 no. I think, I think, let's see, the stock exhaust is a double, let's give it the triple. Sounds like power. Let's see, the hood, sport vents on the hood. Mirrors? Yeah, let's just leave that as a respray, that's what we're looking for. Primary color, metallic. Now, lime green would be great, but we haven't... What do we need that? 11 more stunt jumps. We have to do that. Purple works. Shaft... Ooh, shaft of purple. That's kind of... Where is that darn... Ultra blue... We just use crew blue if we're going to do that. Do yellow. This reminds me of the uh, the all electric version of the the AMG Black that they had on, uh, on I think it was on Top Gear. Oh, and we need obviously we're going to need a spoiler. Uh, is there a secondary? Is there even a secondary color? 
I think only if you if you fit something. Now let's leave that alone. Let's put let's uh, skirts. Spoiler. We need a spoiler because oh, the no spoiler is is an option. All right, that's just silly. Let's let's do the no spoiler option just for just for silliness. So this is the card. If you want to send a message, one 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 more way to send a message to Rockstar is you immediately get a slug and GT because it's such a rare item. A car without the handle. It's a beautiful thing. And again, you know, roughly as far as I'm concerned, I'm sure the rest of the community backs me up on this. We will watch our videos. You know I never missed a choking every time. So if you want to hold off doing all of these handling flag cars until maybe, maybe the flags get taken away, we'll, we'll back you up on that. I know you're probably not going to take that advice. You're gonna suffer through. You're gonna work through it all. Because people, people, just—they're actually kind of, you know, ridiculous in terms of the demands they put on you. When's the car? When are you gonna review this? It's out. Oh my goodness, I can't breathe. You know that kind of thing. But I just want you to know, from at least from from your buddy the Black Knight over here, you do not have to to suffer when you're making your videos anymore. As far as I'm concerned, we will. Let us know which ones have the flags. Let us know how they're doing, maybe. That'd be great. That'd be great. You could just do the ones that don't have flags. That'd be great. And like I said, if you want to support this and try and see if we can talk Rockstar into to not experimenting with the content they're trying to sell to us here, giving us these weird cars that have all kinds of weird flags. They're really only good potentially for stunt races. Um, that'd be great. That is a beautiful car. I'm liking it. I'm digging it. I'm liking the color. And on that note, this is your Black Knight, ladies and gentlemen. Have a great night. Oh, dear. I'm gonna blow up. Oh no, I landed it! Nice.